the hospital after being shot at a party. His, he has non-life-threatening injuries. The El Paso County Sheriff's Office says they responded to a shots-fired call in the 200 block of Cunningham Drive around 11.30 last night. KRDO News Channel 13's Coral Winder spoke with a neighbor who says it was a scary night. Someone came up to the house and started shooting. A frightening situation that led to a rude awakening for Lisa Logan. Not a, not a good way to wake up and uh, have the new year be started, you know, having a shooting in your neighborhood right across the street. She says hearing gunshots in her neighborhood made her concerned. I mean, we have, you know, like I said, we've got our family staying with us, and, you know, the first thing you think is, is it going to hit the house? Do we need to get, you know, away from the windows and that kind of thing? So, yeah, it's very scary. And gunshots led to chaos. I had looked out in the window, and there was a car parked out in front of our house um, with, and then somebody was running through our yard, kind of up through the front. El Paso County Sheriff's deputies say a shootout happened near this house with one person being sent to the hospital. Multiple people, up to 50 is what I'm being told, um, were at one residence and came down here to the Cunningham Drive address. As for Logan, she says all she and her daughter in law can do are pick up the pieces from last night. And just keep a closer eye on the neighborhood. In El Paso County, Carl Winder, KRDO News Channel 13. Thank you, Carl. The victim and suspects have not been identified, and a motive has not been released. The case is still under investigation.